Quality sex. They're in different circumstances. This would be totally awesome. Summer begins. It's time to live up to our name. This is our Hail Mary. With the end game. You know your teams, you know your missions. Look out for each other. Oh, God. What's up, regular size man? <laughs> Avengers Endgame. Rated PG-13. Tickets on sale now. How's it going, everybody? It's Warren, and we are just getting a ton of new promotional spots and TV spots for Avengers Endgame, all of which have a little bit of new footage, and we're probably going to get a new TV spot every day or every other day leading up to the movie. This new TV spot has a few new scenes. Some are funny, some are really cool, but one is a major confirmation about a scene in Avengers Endgame. I'll break it all down in this video, but first, if you're new to my channel, I'm giving away a life-sized Infinity Gauntlet and a glow-in-the-dark Thanos painting by Glow by Bo. All you have to do to enter is be subscribed to my channel, like this video, and comment down below with your thoughts and your favorite superhero or villain. So, the first scene that we have is of Clint and Natasha looking out the window of the ship. Clint says under different circumstances this would actually be awesome. What he's referring to is going into space. And what he's saying is it would be awesome under any different circumstance to go into space, but in this particular case, he's going into space to fight Thanos, the mad titan who just killed half of the universe. And then a few seconds later on into the trailer, we see Clint and Natasha in the front seats actually going into space. And then the next scene, we get our first action shot of Ronin. It's very brief, but it's the first time that we see him actually use his sword in combat. Combat. We know he's in Japan and we know that he's fighting the Yakuza, so it looks like we're going to see some pretty awesome Ronin action in the beginning of Avengers Endgame. Now the next scene has a major reveal in it. We have the scene where the Avengers are walking outside of the Avengers headquarters at nighttime, all looking up into the sky, but look who's there with them this time. No one other than Pepper Potts, which means that this is the scene where Tony Stark and Nebula come back to Earth. Now, this is something that we all expected for a very long time. We all assumed that somebody was CGI'd out of this scene. And as it turns out, we were right. It was Pepper Potts. We know that when Captain Marvel first arrives, the Avengers see her for the first time inside of the Avengers headquarters. We know this from the post credit scene of Captain Marvel. So this scene means that the Avengers aren't going outside to see Captain Marvel return, but they're going outside to see Tony Stark and Nebula return. And that is definitely confirmed by Pepper Potts being in this scene. We then get a slightly different look at the Avengers in their all white suits, and we hear Captain America say, you know your teams, you know your missions. Again, implying that they're going to be splitting up during Avengers Endgame game again, most likely going back in time to different points. And then this TV spot ends with a funny scene, new footage of War Machine jumping down and scaring Ant-Man. Or should I say regular sized man as War Machine calls him. Oh God. What's up regular sized man? <laughs> so this machine of Ant-Man and War Machine and then immediately after of Tony and Captain seems to be after the time jump, after the Avengers go and fight Thanos and lose in the beginning, a few years go by and then Ant-Man returns. After Ant-Man returns, there's now hope and Tony Stark realizes that they can time travel so he calls all of the Avengers back. And this seems to be a scene where all of the Avengers are starting to come back to the Avengers headquarters where Tony Stark and Ant-Man can tell them about the plan to time travel. And that's it for all the new scenes in this new TV spot trailer. Let me know what you think about this and let me know how surprised you were that Marvel actually revealed that it is Pepper Potts in that one scene. It is very interesting that they would show us that so close to the movie being released in theaters. Let me know what you think in the comments down below. And again, if you would like to enter my giveaway for your chance to win a life-sized Infinity Gauntlet and a glow-in-the-dark Thanos painting by Glow by Bo, and you can also find more of his work at glowbybo.com, you can find the link in the description down below. All you have to do is subscribe to my channel, like this video, and comment down below with your thoughts and your favorite superhero or villain. As always, thank you all so much for watching. Woof woof.